Hank and Swain, 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 Hank and it's a nice day to feel alright out here. Got some great clouds above my head, so it's about to rain. So let me go ahead and bring y'all this here review before it do so. You feel me? So we're gonna head and start off with this here box. You feel me? Got this nice old dark midnight navy, you might well say. Air drawing for a shoe box, man. You know, drawing for us be giving us those speckle box lately, man. And I'm kind of digging it, you feel me? The speckle box got these little kind of like silver type speckles on it, man. That's dope. Dope touch with the flight on top with the red jump, man. I don't know if y'all can see that little shiny shine on those speckles or not. But it's there. And the tab, the label reads, air drum for a retro white midnight navy. And these are supposed to retail for 210 that it says. So, uh, yeah. That's that. That's that. Go ahead and dig onto this here box, man. Yeah. And you got that cement paper, you know. You know what it is. <sighs> Bam. I gotta get all that harmony, harmony, harmony. You feel me? This is that Air Jordan 4 Midnight Navy, man. Go ahead and get this other shoe out and let's get on get started with this here review. Nothing that special about it, but I got a, some old paper under the cement paper, the white paper. And that's pretty much it. Got this little green and white sticker on the inside. That's that. But y'all here for the shoes, man. Only like half of y'all, handful of y'all like the box. I don't care for the box. I'm all about the shoes, man, the quality. So that's exactly what we're gonna check out on this here. Midnight Navy at Jordan Fours. And if y'all been following me for a long time, y'all already know that Jordan Fours is one of my favorite Jordan silhouettes, man. Just can't go wrong with fours, man. Fours, ones, and elevens. Pretty much can't go wrong with those. But yeah, in hand, first impression, they all right, man. They all right. It's like the first, like the, the Midnight Navy that I've seen the first time. They, I think they had like the blue or maybe black with a little cement set. And then they just changed it. They updated it and switched it all around and gave us these little speckles and stuff on the shoe, making it look more like white. Cement, right? Oreo, whatever you call them, damn dog food. I think it's white cement, yeah. So it look more like that. Can you put you in the mind of those? But they look good to me. The quality look nice. Some good ass white leather on this motor. Yeah. But let's go ahead and flip this camera around, man, and get up close and personal with these shoes, man. Let's see what's happening with it. Let's get it. Let's go. So good, people. Here we are, your yeah. Air Jordan 4 Midnight Navy. I'm guessing that's gonna be the official name for this here. Jordan, I think these release in September or October, I believe. Can't, you know, I, mean, I can't keep up with these dates anymore because they've been pushing back like every goddamn Jordan that's supposed to be releasing this year. They've been pushing back. I think these supposed to have to drop this month. And they've been pushed back a month or two. Never know. But yeah. First impression, man. Let's check out this white leather. Going to get the shoe tree. Put the shoe here so y'all can see how good this leather is, man. Look at that. It's almost like it's tumbled leather. That's that real white leather, too, man. I don't think they got any synthetic. Usually when they put synthetic on the shoe, it used to be around the back or maybe towards the laces where they even put the synthetic type leather on their Jordans. But it seems like they got it pretty much everywhere and it's looking damn good, thick too. Get it. Got the 
midnight navy on the waffle laces and you got that nice gray on the wing with the let me see if they black or blue speckles oh yeah that's blue that's that blue speckles on that nice nice yeah, i'm digging this blue man it's a nice little dark blue what y'all think on the mid so got the white on the mid so with this nice navy blue air bubble looking real nice and tough and it's gray on the inside let's check out this tone you got that midnight blue navy whatever jump man with the red flight mm, interesting white shoelaces check out the inside y'all see that yep sexy shoe man check out that booty got that blue jump man on the booty on this thing oh we got a little mm, i don't know about that I like some paint rubbing off on that but <laughs> Let's check out the bottom, man. They got that white, navy blue, and red on the bottom. See that that red and navy blue and white? They, they look good. They gotta go good together. It's like maybe they should have put some more red somewhere on top of this shoe. Maybe they should have switched the flight and the jump, man. Maybe the jump man should have been red and the flight should have been navy blue. What y'all think? Or maybe the back. Jumpman should have been red. I don't know. It's like they should have put some extra red somewhere above the shoe. That probably would really set this thing off, you know? Got that cage looking nice. Inside. Navy blue on the inside with the white jump man. Tag. I don't know if y'all can see it. Because I can't fold this thing up like that. But anyways, size 10, production date. 3922 6122 so this year yeah yeah check out the other shoe and then we're gonna end this video off yeah she nice she nice let's go ahead and see that nice leather on this here shoe yep yep she ready she ready and yes these are ua's people these are ua sneakers Looking damn good. Looking just like the retail. Mmm, smell like it too. <laughs> Y'all get on it, man. Inside, got that navy blue on the inside with that Air Jordan with that red stitching on the outside. That's dope. I guess that's that red that they want to add up on the top, but on the inside of the tall, though. Ah. But yeah, these dope, man. I fought with them. You know what I mean? What I prefer the first version they had with the black instead of this little speckles and all that. Yeah. But hey, ain't nothing wrong with this, man. If y'all like the white cement, you should be digging these too. But anyways, man, I'm going to go ahead and jump off this video and put these things on so y'all can see how it look on feet, man. But if you enjoy my review, go ahead and do me a huge favor. Hit that thumbs up and subscribe to your boy, Mr. Hanger Swain, man. If you want to know any more information about this here shoe, what I got it from or what not, go ahead and hit me up on Instagram, man. Don't be shy. Hanger Swain, hang your teeth right there on the video, man. And I'll answer any questions that you may have. You did. Other than that, y'all be good, man. And if you can't be good, be good at it.